All right, let's continue our dive through the general metrics of Cass. We're now going to proceed to the secret base and do uh, this one here. Yes. Hey, Cass, are you there? Hey, Delta, this isn't good. Cass is looking all over for you. There you are. Where do you think you're going? Uh, I found you. You disappeared all of a sudden. I was so lonely. Uh, what? You're joking. Who the hell is this supposed to be? Don't bring weird people into my base. How dare you bring another woman home? The nerve! Wow, so this is a translation in Derelish? Is this an interpreter? My, this is fascinating. Arr, how dare you interrupt me! You're supposed to talk to me, and only me. Hey now, why don't you just hear me out? Cass, that hollow warrior, don't worry about him, he won't attack, so let's make amends with the Empire. Delta, you're being tricked. Just leave me alone. Get out of here. You don't know anything about this world. It's dangerous for you here. Please, I don't want my Delta to be in danger. If you don't leave, I'll throw you into the brig again. I, I can't protect you, but I want to be by your side. It would make me feel better if you were secure in the safe. Ah, shut up! I didn't say anything close to that! It's all true, I swear. Please, Delta, don't be, misle don't be misled by my words and realize my true feelings. Ugh, I can't do this anymore. I hate you, Delta. I'm so embarrassed. You knowing how I feel, it's... What if you hate me now? Whoa there. Stop, stop. You can stop now, Sundaren. Understood. Ah, I can't contain it anymore. I have to know more about her. I'm going to do some research. But, hey, t I still don't get her. Even in this world. I hate you, Delta. Cass, don't cry. I'm not going to hate you, alright? It's not like I'm worried about you hating me or anything. Why don't you tell me more about yourself and your country? I might be able to help, you know? Okay. This country used to be peaceful until about six months ago. Six months? That's about the time I broke down the wall. Six months ago, the Hello Warrior appeared out of nowhere and the Dare Empire invaded at the same time. I see. The Dare Empire is trying to bring our country to its knees with that monster. That's why we must defeat it. But I don't know if we can defeat it, which is why we're doomed. Hey, calm down there, alright? There's one thing I can say for sure. The Hollow Warrior isn't their weapon. You lie. How can that be true? Trust me on this one. Do you honestly expect me to trust you after all these lies? I knew it. You're a spy for the Dare Empire. Man, this conversation isn't going anywhere. Uh... Hmm... Let's gently comfort her? Uh, I don't know what to choose. Alright, we'll gently comfort her. Cass, calm down and look me in the eye. Listen, I'm always on your side, Cass. I would never lie to you. I don't want to destroy this world, and to prove it, I'm going to go defeat the Hollow Warrior right now. There's no way you can do that. Of course I can. I decided I'm going to protect you. You remember that, right? Yeah, but you can't this time. It's impossible. What makes you feel that way? Because... Eek! What's going on? Commander, we have an emergency. The Halo Warrior has started its attack. What? What did you say? Sergeant Caddy, send all of our troops to the Hills of Ruins. To the Hill of Ruins. Ma'am? I should have known better than to trust you. How foolish. God, I hate you. 
Hey, Cass. What the hell's going on here? Hmm. Interesting. So now we have the hill with ruins. I want to unlock more song magic. So, well, it's also kind of interesting too. Oh, it actually looks really intimidating up close. <laughs> that face of mine. It just looks too evil to be me. <laughs> Hey Delta, you came. Of course, I said I'd defeat it, so here I am. Where's Cass? The commander's not here. Actually, she's never been to the front lines. What? She's the commander and she hasn't even seen the front lines? Commander gets scared pretty easily. She pulls back on battles she can win. She pulls back on battles she can win. And, well, it's a huge mess. What happened? Why is she not so confident in herself? Hey, what's going on here? Uh, you're, you're... If it isn't Kasulu the Great, what brings you here? That's my line. Why is the Hollow Warrior moving? Whoa! The town's under attack again. We need to do something to stop it. Delta, what the hell did you say to Cass? If you don't end this, we'll be apart forever! Nothing, really. I just told her I'm going to defeat the Hollow Warrior. That's all. Are you sure? Yeah, that's it. And then this guy started attacking us out of nowhere. Delta, I think I'm beginning to understand. Huh? Understand what? Why this guy's moving? She's afraid of him being defeated. What? I have no idea what you mean. I said this before, but the Hollow Warrior isn't something we brought. It's impossible, not from our world. Which means it has to have been produced in this world. Everything that's materialized here is from Cass. So the Hallow Warrior moving or not moving, it's all a representation of her state of mind. I see, but how can you tell she doesn't want it defeated? It started moving when you talked about defeating it. I impossible, I mean, she was shocked, right? Remember, this is inside her mind. That girl is an actualization of a part of her mind, but even deeper, she still is her subconscious. This world has been created by that higher tier of caste. It's her thoughts alone that move this world, even if she's unaware of it. Okay, so what we need to do then is find Cass and do something about this monster, right? If we don't, then you'll never be able to enter this world again. Alright, then I'm going to go and look for Cass. Take good care of the commander for us. Yeah, leave it to me, Sergeant Kitty Ears. That, that's catty to you. Don't get it wrong. It's going to be sad going our separate ways, but you'll find Cass and come right back, right? Yeah, you leave it to me. Man, this is starting to feel like a war drama. Things are finally getting interesting. It'll be fun watching you resolve this issue. I'll be watching. <sighs> you make it sound like it's not your problem. By the way, is it really going to make Cass sad if the Hallow Warrior falls? I suspect so. The timing of the attack was too good. It must have something to do with what you said. Cass is probably afraid of something changing. Hmm. Alright. Now to the Vault of Importance. What? This is where you were? Delta, how did you know I was here? I searched all over. You weren't on the hill and Caddy said you were afraid, so here we are. I, I see. Do you spend a lot of time here? Yeah. When the war breaks out, this is usually where I go. But when I came here the first time, you saved me inside the city, remember? Th that was just a coincidence. You were lucky. I was really scared, but I gathered up all my courage to save you, Delta. N no, that's... Not entirely wrong. <laughs> I see now. Thanks for saving me. Are you actually afraid of me? Is that why the Hallow Warrior showed up? You told me it was exactly six months ago when I took down the barrier. You're afraid, right? 
Yes, I'm afraid of you, and I can't trust you. Six months ago, you tore down a barrier for no reason, and as a result, Felion was almost destroyed. Even now you're saying it's because you wanted to save Felion, but... Everyone says you're a spy. I, at the very least, I wanted to believe you, but... I don't have enough proof, so I, I can't. I feel bad for putting you in this situation. It's my fault you're torn like this. True, there were a lot of victims, but I don't think I made the wrong decisions. Which is why I want to find out the reason behind my actions. I'm not stopping here. Stop it, you don't have to. I'm afraid. Even if you found an explanation and it's not as noble as you think, I don't think if I I don't know if I can recover. Even then, I'll figure out what happened because you're all I have. Cass? Delta? Remember when I was tried and thrown into prison? You're the only one who vouched for me. How do you... I know these things. And thanks to you, here I am now, living a normal life. I feel like I can make it through the hardship because you understand and believe in me. That That's good. That's why I want to be by your side from now on. We can't continue to live like this. Whether it's black or white, we'll find out the truth. We need to let go of our reservations to move forward. Yeah, you're right. Let's defeat the Hollow Warrior together. If we combine our strengths, we can do anything. But he's really strong. We couldn't leave a scratch no matter what we did. Eek! Cass, you okay? I'm fine. This is a safe place. I doubt they can get through that easily. But he's definitely trying to find this place. You think he noticed us? We need to do something quick, or he'll erase us first. But how can we defeat him? I have a suggestion. You? You can talk normally too? Obviously, you shouldn't underestimate me. So... You were a sun dare after all too, huh? I don't know why I'm surprised. So what's your suggestion? We use my ultimate weapon, the Cat Fighter Bomb. That way we might stand a chance. Alright. Let's, sounds good. Let's do it. Hey, let me finish. We bring the fight to him first. Let's go, Cass. Hmm. Okay, so we go back up to the hills with ruins. Uh, here. Yes. Commander, where have you been? Delta, you came back for me. Oh, that makes me so happy. When I saw you on the other side of the hill, my heart skipped a beat. Hey you, what the heck do you think you're saying? You're supposed to be me. Yes, I'm you, and you're me. Now, let's not get jealous, alright? That's the problem, you're me, and everything you're saying is super embarrassing. Hey, Sundarin. Can't you bust out that bomber thing from earlier? Oh, stop rushing me. Get ready for it. Here it goes. There! Whoa. Name and design aside, it definitely leaves quite an impact. We might actually be able to defeat that guy with this. It amplifies emotions to crush its opponents. You just have to express how you feel through the mic. But there's a problem. This device only reacts to true feelings. Nothing superficial. And no matter what it is, it will amplify true intent, even if that means destroying the world. And finally, this device can only be used by this world's... ruler. Which means you're the only one who can use it, Cass. What? I have to do it? Good luck, Cass. Remember, our conversation from earlier. We need to defeat this guy and keep going. Yes, I suppose you're right. Very well. Cass, go! Hey, Cass, what's the matter? Ugh! Eek! Cass, what are you doing? Get a grip! I, I can't, I, I just can't! Because defeating the Hallow Warrior means 
I have to trust you completely, right Delta? Sorry, I'm just not ready for that yet. Even if I scream into that mic, it just won't... Cass... Just shout your honest feelings. Don't overthink it, just say whatever's on your mind right now. Huh? Because the machine only reacts to honest feelings, there's no use trying to cover it up, right? Then, just risk it all and throw your honest feelings at it. But, what if this world rejects you as a result? Then, I... <laughs> don't worry. It'll take a lot more than that to make me leave. I don't mean to sound arrogant, but my feelings for you are stronger than yours that want to get rid of me. Delta, thanks. I'll try. Go! Here it goes. I just can't trust you, Delta. I don't know what goes on in that head of yours. But I do want to believe in you. I want to be by your side too. It's true. I want to believe you. But I can't. So please, for the time being, stay there and don't move. Please. Stop? It looks like the Hollow Warrior stopped attacking. Alright, you did it. Good job, Cass. No. Huh? Because we haven't defeated it yet. We only stopped it temporarily. I'm sure it'll begin to move again. Sorry, Delta everyone. This is the best I can do right now. I couldn't defeat him because I couldn't completely believe in you, Delta. Don't be stupid. Why are you apologizing? There's no need for that. We were able to stop it. That seems like quite the accomplishment to me. For now, this brought us a lot of time. This bought us a lot of time. Time for the two of us to understand each other. Exactly. And I don't think the Hollow Warrior stopped its attack. Stopping its attack is the only thing that's changed. Huh? That's... You should respond honestly. I know it might sound out of character, but these things piss me off. Delta... Hmm? What's up? In order to understand you more, Delta, I thought it would be okay to let you see more... Of your body? No, you idiot! Inside my mind! <sighs> so, let's go deeper together. Into my mind, and... My heart. Cass, you're... But... I'm scared too, you know? Of course I'm scared. And I'm still not completely convinced. I wasn't lying when I said I wanted to believe in you, so... I'll do what I can to muster up the courage. <laughs> that makes me happy. Really? Of course it does, I mean... The partner I cherish is opening up her heart to me. Though it might only be a little bit right now. <laughs> okay, well... You better be thankful. Hmm. Whoa, what the heck is that thing? The ruler of this world in thoughts has accepted your feelings for each other. It's called the embrace roll. Who's the ruler of thoughts? Is it Cass? <laughs> no. On each floor of general metrics, there's a personification of that floor's theme. In this world, the personification was Sundarain. She was supposed to represent this world? Yes, she was the materialization of what must be completed in this world. The theme was to organize her feelings towards Delta and decide where she stands. And she has decided to go deeper with you, together. I see. Now, let's travel to Hymnofort, before Cass changes her mind. Why? Because we have to perform the ritual to proceed to the next level. Hurry! Uh, okay. Alright. What do we got here? 100 points. And we get a song. Nice. So let's see what happens here. Hey, Delta. What's taking you so long? Ugh, don't make us wait. It's so lonely here without you. Ah, <sighs> enough with the translations. Delta, thank you. Now we're one step closer to seeing my floor. One step? 
Yep, one step. My floor's pretty deep after all. I, I see. So, I'm sure we'll run into a lot more obstacles on our way, but I want you to make it there, promise? Yeah, leave it to me. Uh, Delta, too much talking. Let's hurry up and get this ritual or whatever over with. Calm down, Cass. You can't possibly perform the ritual in your current mental state. So, what exactly do we have to do? I know it's called a ritual, but it's actually quite easy. You two just need to open this door together. What? That's it? Not to mention we can easily walk around this door. <sighs> That's why you're an idiot. There's meaning to the ritual in opening the door. Exactly. By opening this door together, our hearts will mature together, strengthening our bond. If you can do this, you'll both be able to travel to a deeper level of mental communication. Right. Okay. Well, in that case, let's get started, Cass. Okay. Delta, thanks again. I feel like we've been brought closer together because of you. But I feel like there are still a lot of reservations on my mind. Moving forward means I need to face each and every one of those problems and... <laughs> so we've got even more problems ahead of us then. Looks like it's going to be a long road. Would you like to call it quits here for today? Of course not. This is part of the journey, right? Well, I'm ready for it, as long as Cass is by my side. Okay. Well, I guess we should go through this door. Damn right. Tch, what troublesome children. Who would have thought it would take this long just to get to the door? The wall in my heart is quite thick, I admit. I didn't think we would make it. Perhaps we were right in dragging it out, though we might have overdone it a bit. Is this what you call the ground when it hardens after the rain falls? <laughs> I suppose so. Well, I better return to my own floor. Regardless of how, it's good that the gate has opened. Delta, hurry up and come to my floor. Alright, so we've woven cast Song Magic Sundering. So I'm assuming it's that big drum thing. Neat! Good work, it looks like you managed to bring back powerful thoughts. So... We got a crystal. Another crystal. And... What's this? Delta, do you have a moment? What's up? Well, um, you see... I don't mind, you know. What are you talking about? The ritual. Ritual? Oh, you mean that thing where we immerse ourselves in water and infuse feelings into each other? Where's this coming from, though? Didn't you hate the ritual? Well, yes. Well, I was never going to do it back then. But now, I suppose it's not as bad as it used to be. I don't know why, maybe it's because you're working so hard on the Genometrics, Delta. So we can now perform the Purification Ceremony with Cass. Excellent. So we just have to go to the Purification Site. Alright, so I believe we will then do that. What is this? I don't know what that was. Encyclopedia? No. History? No. Uh, what was that? I have no idea what that was. Maybe it's just things uh, I unlock from like the main menu maybe. Because there is that in Artonelical 3 where you could see like the event scenes from the diving in. But anyways, so that was pretty neat. So we kind of got a little bit of backstory too with the basically the relationship between Delta and Cass and how she basically wants to trust him but doesn't. She suspects that he actually did something that he shouldn't have done. Uh, and so she's still suspicious of that, but she still is, feels safe around him, but she doesn't trust what he did or why he did what he did. So 
we'll see if uh, what comes of that. But anyways, we'll take a break there and we'll continue on next time. So thanks for watching.